Oi oi guys, welcome back to another budget guitar show. Now recently you saw me do a video on the Harley Benton SC1000 with active pickups that I purchased because A I wanted one and B because the weight of this Epiphone with the Gibson T-top pickups is now starting to really rankle on my back when playing live. Nothing wrong with either guitar but in this video, I want to find out which one's best. So, let's start the show. Here's Johnny. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is have a little blind test of both guitars. Now, the Epiphone will be guitar A, and the Harley Benton will be guitar B. But in this blind test, which one am I playing first, and which one am I playing second? Let's take a listen. <laughs> Okay, so what did you guys think? Which one was I actually using first and which was I playing second? Well, here we go. The first one I played was Guitar B, which is the Harley Benton with the active pickups. And the second one, of course, was the Epiphone with the Gibson passive pickups. Now, from what I heard from those there wasn't a great deal of difference i think the epiphone was clearer whereas the harley benton had a lot of real gain to it both were going through my pedal board which you can see a video on up here and all using the same settings so let's take a look at those two clips so you can see for yourself. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to do a little weight test between both guitars. So let's start off with the Epiphone, which is the heavier of the two. Onto the scale, this one is weighing in at four kilograms. 
and now to the Harley Benton, which is the lighter of the two. And this gives us weight of just over three kilograms. Okay, let's do some standing comfortability tests. Now standing with the Epiphone on and in a playing position, um, it does feel really comfortable and I do enjoy playing this guitar. But as I say, when you're using this guitar and doing a sort of 90 minute set, it can really start to feel like your back is going to go once you take the guitar off. But with the Harley Benton, you do not get that. This, while not being as light as a feather, it still has that little bit of weight to it, but it just does feel a lot more comfortable. Okay, now let's try a standing playing test with both guitars. <laughs> And just for good measure, we're going to throw in the Gretsch into that little mix as well, right now. <laughs> So ultimately what I'm saying here is which one would I take as my main guitar to gig? Okay, well the Epiphone has a lot going for it, but the one thing it does have that isn't really going for it is the weight. The Harley Benton, well that has a real lot of gain to it, and while it feels good to play, that gain will need to be dialed back a bit just to uh, give it the kind of sound that I want. The Gretsch, well, I'll always be taking that one to gig with because yet yeah, it is a little heavy, but it just plays fantastically well. So which is the best out of the Epiphone and the Harley Benton? You let me know down in the comments your thoughts. Okay guys, thanks once again for joining me in this video. And thank you to our budget backers who are of course right here. If you wish to join them and help support the channel, you know what to do down below with the join button. Also, if you've enjoyed this video, why not give it a thumbs up because that really does help the channel out and why not subscribe if you're new here there is loads of content coming up and it just remains for me to say stay safe stay sane but do keep rocking